Hello everyone, this is Steven with Renergy and Podex Go. This is our brand new Grande S1 prototype tiny house. The main thing that we're excited about, it is a fully street legal tiny house. So you're able to get it small, take it on the road, and then once you park it, you could deploy it to a 22 and a half wide living quarters, which equates to 364 square feet total. So it's a great size, you're not gonna have any issues, and the fact that it's street legal is one of the biggest key factors. So the length of the unit is gonna be 20 feet long. So when you have it completely folded, you're at eight and a half feet wide and 20 foot long. Completely street legal, and if you have the accessible towing vehicle, you're able to take it down the road with no problems at all. So here we have the stairs and the awning. These fold out when you're deployed and then they fold in when you're ready to hit the road. Same thing over here. So here we have the pistons, which are gonna control the automatically deployable units. With a touch of a few buttons, you're able to fold in and fold out the unit at ease. Now we're gonna go ahead and go to the back and show you the energy system that's powering the whole Grande S1. So here we have the command center. So you can see the key is engaged and you can see all the indicators. And then down here you have the four buttons that are gonna be able to handle the hydraulics, the expansion, at the same time leveling the system completely. So you have everything that you need to set up the system right here at your fingertips. And now if we go down here, this is gonna be the bread and butter of the power system. So this is the Renogy Lycan power box. It's actually five kilowatts of power and it has the internal batteries, your solar inverter charger, and all of the necessary components that you need to be completely powered off the grid. And it's tied into our solar system on the roof. So we have eight 175 watt panels on the roof, which is gonna be a 1400 watt solar system. So that's 1.4 kilowatts of solar on your tiny house. So it's a great size. It's really keeping up with the demands and it's keeping everything charged. So you're able to use all of the power at your fingertips whenever you need. Again, here we have five kilowatts of available power, which is a lot of power but for any application that you may need more, we are exploring different options with this prototype. So here we have the Aura system. This guy has five kilowatts of stackable storage. Currently we have 15 kilowatts. It could expand all the way up to 20 kilowatts. So like I said, with this unit, we are exploring different options to really have the most power accessible. Up here, we're actually gonna have the water heater all the way up on top. Right underneath is gonna be the mini split blower. So the control center does allow you to automatically open up the unit and level everything. Sometimes you do need to do a little bit of fine tuning and that's where the hydraulics control comes in. So here you can see everything, all of the controls for all the different pistons to control the legs and make sure that you are completely leveled wherever you park. I would like to show you what's going on inside with all of the features, so let's go. So this is the inside of the Grande S1 prototype tiny house. It is again 364 square foot of single level living space, which provides a lot of comfort and ease of movement. So this is gonna be the living room kitchen area. And here you can see the table. This table is awesome because you're actually able to fold it out and fold it in. And the chairs are easily foldable and they actually slide right in here. So this is gonna be the kitchen area. So up here you have your cabinets which could be used as a great pantry area. And you can put all of your kitchen stuff in here, tucked away. And we're also exploring the option of having an oven in this area as well. Nice soft clothes cabinets. And then you have your fridge and freezer area as well. So we have a very efficient fridge. So it's not gonna consume too much out of your battery pack. And you're still able to freeze ice and keep all of your food cold in the fridge. So here we have the kitchenette area. We have loads of space up top and on the bottom. So you can see over here, we have two cabinets up top and then we have two cabinets down the bottom as well. So basically a full kitchenette where you can store everything that you need, everything that you might you know, need for a kitchen, it will be at your fingertips and stored away nicely. So here we have the sink. The sink is great because we have a nice cover that keeps it flush. Once you take the cover off, you do have a nice dish basket as well. So you put all your dishes in here when you're washing them. 
Right here, we're actually gonna have the hot plate as well. So the hot plate, you're able to use the teapot, you're able to heat up your, you know, any kind of food. And when you're not using it, you can put it away and you can utilize all the counter space. So here we have the living room area. You can see the furniture, which is included with the Grande S1 model. We have the coffee table, which is a nice compact size. Here we have a very nice, comfortable couch, which can be expanded into a sleeper. So if anybody needs to sleep in the living room area, you're able to do that. Over here, you can see the floor space, huge. You can still do yoga, you can do exercising. And then we have these beautiful windows. You can see they're nice blinds come up and down very nice to keep all the shade in, keep the sun out. So the Grande S1 is fully livable now, but we are listening to all of the feedback and we are continuously making improvements. So if we look over here, you can see at some of the connection points, you see some light coming through. So it is completely sealed right now, but we're using a clear rubber seal. So you can see all of that light coming through. One thing that we are improving, we're gonna have a black seal. So you won't see that light coming through anymore. So over here we have the bathroom. As you can see, it is a compact size, but it's enough room to really do everything that you need. Over here we have the shower area, and we utilized a nice shower curtain, and we didn't use a door so you could really utilize all the space in here. And the whole bathroom is a wet bathroom, so you can actually get everything wet in here. It can stay wet and nothing's gonna get damaged, which, which is great. Currently, we have three different options for the housing layout. This one is gonna be an open layout, and then we have different options as well, depending on the privacy needs uh, on the end user. The Grande S1 does have a base price of $85,000. We're gonna have different payment plans, different financing options, and at the same time, there's gonna be different options to expand. So if you want something that's a little bit more advanced, has a little bit more bells and whistles, those options will be there as well. And then also getting the unit, it's very easy. You know, it's gonna take a couple clicks. You could jump online, uh, you could place the order and in about 90 days we'll be delivering it to your doorstep. Another option to purchasing the Grande S1, you can go through any of our partners. So you could go online or you could come directly to our showroom. So we have it here in Ontario, California. Come on by, we love seeing people and you can take a full tour to see what's going on. So over here in the front of the house, we're gonna have the foyer. So we have a nice area. You can put you know, anything right here. Down here is empty. You can throw your shoes. You can throw anything that you need. At the same time, we do offer a washer dryer combo that will fit in this area as well. Up here, we have more cabinet space where we have all of the server, all of the Wi-Fi, and all the control of the system. So here we have the NOAA certification. The NOAA certification is basically saying that we are RV certified. It also helps with financing, insurance, and parking it. So here we're gonna have the system hub, which is the edge one. You can see all the information about what's happening in the system, uh, coming in through the battery, coming in from your solar system, and basically what you're running through the system. So your lights, your refrigerator, TVs, and we have a lot of sensors on here. So when the doors are open, it's gonna tell you when the doors are open, when the windows are open. So we have a lot of motion sensors on here. So you can kind of see, you have temperature control. So you can set the temperature, make sure the climate is you know, set to what you like. And then we also have our full security system. So you can see what's happening around the full perimeter of your tiny house and you know, feel safe wherever you're deployed at. So over here we have the office bedroom area. So right here you can see our office desk. Very nice, very compact, and it's able to fold up and tuck away and get out of the way when you don't need it. So here we have the full closet area. We have different compartments and then we have a safe down here as well. So you can put all your important stuff hidden away and protected. So up top we're actually gonna have the blower for the HVAC system. So when you have the air conditioner going, you can feel the air coming through, or if you have the heater coming through, same thing. On this side of the room, we have the bedroom. So we're gonna have the Murphy bed. It's a queen size bed. You have the comfortable pillows. You have everything that you need. And when you're not using it, you can fold it up and make it flush with the wall. Just like the other side of the house, we have a lot of windows. So you can see outside and you can really enjoy the outdoors with these big windows. So the Grande S1, it doesn't take a long time to set up. Once you park it, the full deployable unit is gonna take anywhere from about 15 to 20 minutes. So it's very quick, it's very awesome, and it's very easy to do. 
With all the furniture here, it makes it very comfortable. You can live and really enjoy everything in this tiny house. Everything is easily stowable when you're ready to pack up and hit the road. All you gotta do is start folding up all the furniture. First is gonna be the office table. Next is gonna be the Murphy bed. Next is gonna be the kitchen table. You're gonna go ahead and fold all of the chairs, stick them in the table and fold the table in. After the kitchen table is folded up, you're gonna go ahead and move it in front of the kitchenette area and make sure that it's out of the way of the folding walls. Next is the sofa. You're gonna go ahead and break down the sofa and put it in the front foyer right by the front door. So the remaining furniture like the computer chair and the coffee table can be stowed away in the bathroom. Once the furniture is put away safely, you're gonna go ahead and go outside and remove the four legs manually. Once those four legs are manually removed, you're gonna go ahead and get the control panel remote and hit the fold button. Once the fold button is engaged, you're gonna see the wall start folding in and this whole process will take about eight minutes and everything will be closed and, and ready for you to go and hit the road. And you can tow the Grande S1 with a F250 pickup truck or equivalent. Or we're happy to connect you with a third party transportation company. And we're inviting all of our customers to come by our Ontario, California warehouse to see the Grand S1 in action. And our engineering team will be here to show you how to set up the system, how to park it, and how to use everything. Currently the products go, we only have the Grande S1 model available, but we have been taking a lot of feedback from our customers and we're gonna be integrating that feedback for future development. So we're gonna have a foundation model and a fully off-grid model as well. If you want to be a part of this journey and provide feedback, you can go onto the website and go join our co-creation lab. A lot of what we integrated into this model was from that co-creation lab. So I would definitely advise, you know, anybody that has any kind of feedback, provide it there. And if it's really good feedback that we do use, you will receive an award as well. So the partnership between PodX Go and Renogy actually happened by us just discussing the options with PodX Go. They needed a power solution and we've been in the market for a long time providing power solutions to the off-grid market. Tiny homes, RVs, vans, the DIYers. And when PodX Go came to us, we had a perfect solution. So we were able to get a good solar solution, a good battery backup system, and provide all of the needs that something like this would need to make sure that you're not gonna have to worry about running out of power. You're not gonna have to worry about, you know, any issues coming up. And if something does come up, you know, Renogy is gonna be here to take care of you. One of the main things with the Grande S1 was really making sure that we were making something that's affordable and accessible to everybody. You know, RVs, smaller uh, uh, tiny houses, they're great, but they come with a lot of, you know, issues here and there. And sometimes it's a little hard, you know, dealing with the ins and outs of, of these tiny houses. So we really made sure that we used all of our resources appropriately and made something that anybody could get into and enjoy a completely livable house, which is awesome. And we really, we love what we did here. We really love the Grande S1 and we're excited to expand on it. Thank you for watching our video and for stopping by Tiny House Expedition. I'm Alexis. And I'm Christian. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And for more tiny home tours and stories, click the videos below. And join us on Instagram for bonus content including face-to-face -face conversations with us. <laughs> we hope to see you there. All right. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.